Okay, one of the easiest ways to speed up your computer is to move your computer's paging file from the main hard drive to a secondary one. Now what the paging file does is it acts as virtual memory uh, so when your computer runs out of physical memory it can start dumping information into the paging file allowing it to continue running without crashing because it ran out of memory. Now unfortunately once you start using a major portion of your paging file uh, your computer will slow down because your hard drive can't read and write all the information fast enough when it's all on the same hard drive. So, to find out whether or not you actually have two hard drives instead of one hard drive that's partitioned into two, as some OEMs do, you can click on the Windows Start Orb, select Computer, right click, click Manage, and then in the Computer Management window click on Disk Management. And now if you see disk 0 and disk 1, or any more than one disk, then you do have two hard drives and this will work for you. If you only see disk 0, but it's divided into two blocks, then that means you only have one hard drive and unfortunately moving your paging file to a separate hard drive won't help speed up your computer, but in that case you can always use ReadyBoost, which effectively just moves the paging file onto a USB flash drive or an SD card so it it's about the same except a little different okay so to actually move the paging file from the main hard drive onto your secondary one you can click start uh, select control panel then scroll down until you find system click that then click on advanced system settings and then under performance click settings then click on the advanced tab and then click under virtual memory click change now by default Vista wants to automatically manage your paging file which is fine except it automatically puts it on the same hard drive as Vista so to move it to the second hard drive you can select your second hard drive select system managed and click set and then select your main hard drive click new paging file and click set. And of course you'll be warned about having less than 200 megabytes and calls errors so you click continue and then you click OK and click OK, OK then exit out of the system panel and you have to restart your computer before the changes fully take effect. Uh, if you like this tip and would like to read more about ways to speed up and improve your computer you can go to caseytech.blogspot.com where we have lots of articles that can help you and make your life easier thanks for watching